Hello I'm a Mac. And I'm a PC. And because of consumer demands, our N4 equipped Macs now come with 16 gigabytes of unified memory of the default standard instead of 8 gigabytes. See, now you're giving people what they want, in a way. But your so-called unified memory is still non-upgradeable, compared to us PCs where you can swap out the RAM modules. Well, people can order us with as much memory as they want. And with the baseline M4 Max, you can now get up to 32 gigabytes, instead of just limiting it to the Pro chips. I saw that. And of course with us PCs, they can upgrade to that amount for a little less money than what people would spend when configuring a Mac order. Who cares about saving money? We're a lot faster and we're built to last compared to PCs. You seem to be forgetting again how we can cater to different worlds. I'm the all-around choice for coders, office productivity users, and especially gamers. Well, you seem to be forgetting that as of Mac OS 14 Sonoma, we had a game mode added similar to the one on Windows 11, along with our Mac game developer kit. That's true, but there are still certain gamers who prefer a PC with swappable parts and a discrete graphics card with dedicated video RAM. So what? Our Apple Silicon chips handle integrated graphics way better than the x86 computers do, almost as good as dedicated RAM, which is one reason why we abandon Intel chips. Yes, and in addition to some gamers, that also made you even more popular with digital artists, graphic designers, video editors, animators and web designers. Hey you're right. We really do still cater to the best of both worlds. And I remember you talking about cross-platform users as well, like this channel's creator. That's the right attitude. And with that said, you think you can tell me how to have Windows operate flawlessly on ARM systems? No.